Hello YouTube, I am Draco Caesar, and today uh, we're gonna get back into Guild Wars. Now it's been a while since I've done this, so let's get back into this. Alright. And Tormuth is dancing. Alright, um, we're gonna start this off with a skill challenge over in Yonder Hills. Now, how do I get down without dying? We don't! Okay. Oh, yeah, I guess I should do that. Alright. So let's just uh, climb down, and I expect I'm going to be attacked here. Nope, I'm not going to get attacked. I'm doing the attacking port. And it's uh, dead. What did we get? A tiny fang. Not compensating for anything, I don't think. Alright, corrupted ice. Let's get this thing going. But yeah, I like how with the Mesmer, great swords are ranged weapons. And I know I've said it before, but it's still really fun. Oh, some people are just leaving. They've uh, already done that skill challenge. So we're not going to have a lot of people to help us. But I think we can do it. In theory. So. Get going on this. Get two uh, corrupted ice dying here, and more dragon banners. There we go. Quest complete. All right, in we go. Um, skill challenge. Oh, got a sign of spawn here. Let's take it out. And let's keep going. There's another corrupted ice. I got the frozen maw. I leveled up and got uh, mighty apprentice band, which is better than what I'm wearing. So I will be equipping that. And okay, we have Our Corrupted Spike skill challenge is right here. And someone has triggered it. Perfect. Um, Am I lagging a little bit? I think I might be lagging a little bit. This isn't fun. But, we're doing just fine. I'm not taking any damage at all. And let's pop this, let's pop this, and people are dying, people aren't dying anymore. Alright. Oh, I'm actually taking damage here. Okay. Oh, of course, everyone's coming at, out of the woodwork here. Alright, let's pop a heal. Alright. Grab this. Do this. Pop that. Just popping everything here, and he's gone. What did he drop for me? An iron axe. Can Mesmers use axes? Mesmers cannot use axes. But what's in my tiny ice bag? Totems. Let's drop this, let's drop that. And, um, I think I'm ready to leave the area. So, um, I, I'm going to keep the pistol. Because I know I can use pistols. Oh, okay, fine. Alright, pop. And dead. Out we go. Oh, there's another sun is fun here. Has Tormuth beat the quest here? Perfect. Alright. Off we go. Um, map. 
There's another skill point. Let's go for it. Or not. All right. Hey, wolf drop stuff for us. All right. Um, we need to go north. Ish. Past the worms. Let's see how we can uh, do just getting by without getting attacked. Veteran Ice Worm. That's a Veteran Ice Worm. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Woo. Jumpity, jumpity, jumpity. Can I attack him yet? He's a little... Oh, no. He's not too far. Perfect. There we go. There we go. Get some good damage off on him. Pop that. Oh, I uh, got hit with something. So, let's win. Bronze. Oh, well. Search. I got a Swindler Mask. And it's uh, medium armor I can't use. Alright. Let's go. The stuff is down here. Alright. Thank you. Um, where's the skill point? Right down here. Okay. Tormeth. Tormeth. Alright, down here. That's not down here. There we go. That's down here. There we go. Okay. Uh, skill point will be over here. And skill challenge. The wild I can handle it. I have a feeling I um I just have to drink it. Yep, double click to gain a skill point. Ooh, a spear. Um, it's as good as my trident. Okay, I'm keeping the trident because I like the look of tridents. Um, did you? Grab the drink. Double click the drink. Drink the drink. Oh, we got a worm. Oh, kind of sucks to be you there. I can't do anything to help you out. Oh. Uh Worm egg. I didn't want to get a worm egg. But, but hey. Oh well. Alright. Another worm egg. Okay, um, okay, fine. We're just collecting worm eggs for a quest. That's what it is. Alright. Thank you. Alright, I'm leaving the, uh... I'm leaving the caves. I don't need to be- oh! There you go. Let's grab another worm egg. And let's leave the cave. Alright. Where's the guy I need to talk to? Him! Alright. I gave him six eggs, and I, uh, that's good enough. Alright. Let's, uh, grab this checkpoint. There we go. Map. And... Alright. Undiscovered point of interest. Quest. And then another uh, waypoint up there. So, let's go this way. What's this quest or quest entail? We'll see you soon enough. Oh, we can see right now. Retrieve frozen kegs from the ice cave and bring them back to Volden. Okay, help Hodir catch frozen kegs. <laughs> help Hodir catch frozen kegs. Aww. Alright, so just 
we're just going to be standing around here catching kegs. Okay. That was a glitch. I glitched out slightly, and I screwed that out too. Alright, um, this isn't, uh, going so well. Oh, God. Way over here. Okay. What else do I have to do? Waken drunken patrons passed out in the snow. Alright, let's see what I can do to wake them up. Can I kick them? Um, no. I need freezing water. Okay. Where do I find freezing water? Probably around here. Alright, there we go. Pick up. I have a thing of free... I have a face full of tent. That's what I had. And... It did wake him up. Beautiful. Alright. Another water bucket. Let's keep waking people up. And... Wakey, wakey. Eggs and bakey. Grab the bucket. And there should be another one over here I thought I saw. Yep, another one right over here. Let's pour it on his face. Won't be the first time he woke up to something cold and wet on his face. Because I'm assuming he's passed out drunk a few times here and uh, other adventurers like me have come over to wake him up. And see, kids, that's how you keep it PG. Mm. Alright. Where's more buckets? Where's an There's more buckets. They keep spawning. We're good. Alright, pick up. And this is going to take some time. So. I think. I may just uh, call this quits for now, come back later to finish it, off camera, and yeah, one more bucket, come back to finish this off camera, and we'll continue on with the uh, session. <laughs> look up at the recording, and it said 13 minutes and 37 seconds as I looked, 2 pro. Okay, well, we'll be back. Uh, let's head up here to Doliak Pass Waypoint, and I could have grabbed the bucket and got him on the way. Oh well, inefficiency is key. There's a blueberry bush, could go for an aspen sapling as well, but let's just grab this and keep going for the Doliak Pass. Uh, could attack some Dolyaks. Oh, Dolyak calves. I need to capture Dolyak calves. Uh oh, uh oh. I'm being attacked. Um, no, 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 you don't, no, you don't. Thought I was supposed to be helping the Dolyaks. Um, could have sworn I was supposed to be helping them. Alright. Um... Alright, um, there's no predators to defend them from, so I can't really do much here. So, let's grab this. I forget how I did this before. But, where do I go now? We could go for that skill point. 
Alright, but I think we'll do that at another point. Let's head west. Follow the road, head west. Alright. Oh, Svanir's dome is up there. We'll get there eventually. I am definitely a little too much low of level for that. So, let's head this way. Armorsmith, Weaponsmith, Merchant, re Repair Shop. We'll get there. Let's take a quick look at ourselves here. And, uh... Oh! Copper. Hit. Hit. And hit. Let's go, let's go. And event successful. Perfect. I knew giving that person those six eggs would help. Alright, fight Sons of Svanir and other dangers around the Haven. Um, I know I can't take that. I am three levels too low, and I uh, actually, um... This is a minefield for me. Let's see what I can do to take one on. Can I? Can I take one on? There we go. And I I can kill one. I don't want to test my luck though and and grab more than one. But because someone's there, let's go. Let's get experience off someone else's kill. They didn't lose anything. But still. Alright. Let's go. And we go in here. We go in here. We grab the waypoint. And we got the waypoint. And I think it's at this point I, uh... I want to change my uh, equipment. Let's try what a pistol does. Um... This pistol's better. So, we'll throw it there. And... Uh, what will my main hand be? That's a great sword. Um, main hand. Let's try one. Alright, let's see what these abilities do. Oh, wrong button. Alright. Alright, um, can't really tell what that does yet. So, we need to actually go out and fight something. Um, do I want to fight a moose? Let's fight a moose. Let's fight a moose. Oh, shit. No, no. Sons of Spawn here. Okay. I'm not sure exactly what all my abilities are doing, but... They're working. They're doing what they're supposed to, I take it. Hey, I got a phantom, uh... I think that's phantom duelist. Alright. So, that shoots a bolt of energy, shoot a second bolt of energy, third bolt of energy that damages your target, and summons a cl clone. Okay. Oh. And third one makes a clone. Okay. Block the next attack. Oh. Let's pop it. There we go. Perfect. And shoot a bolt with the counter spell. Channel a beam of energy that damages and confuses your foe. So that's a channel ability. And Phantasmal Duelist, create an illusion that unloads his pistols on your foe. And Magic Bullet. There's a joke in there about the Magic Bullet. But I'm just not cooking up anything good here. Um, what's that? Okay. Glad we both know what it was. Now, let's check the map. Um, let's head down here, grab this waypoint. Grab this point of interest, and... Yeah, let's go. Whee! 
fight everything on the way to get, uh, check out my new abilities. Like, the greatsword's good. I just want to see what else the Mesmer has to offer. Because you never really know. I can't wait until I get these, though. Level 13 is the earliest. Okay, um... Dum -dum -dum. Wormhole... Worm Howl Spikes. Okay. It's a new area. All's good. Let's grab this tree. And... I'm getting green wood logs. Which is flawless. Because they're going to be helpful later on when crafting becomes a thing. For this character, at least. So, let's grab this point of interest. Almar's down here. Almar, not Olimar. Erica. Guinness Stone Scald. Agatha. And other people I really don't choose to talk about. Alright. And. Let's check the map. Let's check the map. And there's a vista there. But. This is about it for time for this episode. Not very exciting, I know, but we're getting a bit more done in the uh, world. And eventually, we'll be getting some really cool things going on. And frickin' Tormethal is already level 12. The deck. But, hey, that's the way the game goes sometimes. So, if you like what you see, Feel free to subscribe, like the video, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Guild Wars 2. Take care and have yourselves a good day.